Yeah, trailers! They don't stop. This is the weekend of trailers. So we have yet another trailer, and now you get another trailer review, this time for Fantastic Four. That's right, it was Fantastic Four, and then it was rebranded as fan stick Now it's rebranded, rebranded as Fantastic Four from fan stick Those marketing departments. So in the new Fantastic Four trailer, we get more of what's going on in this one. Ultimately, it's this company that's trying to master interdimensional travel. And Reed Richards gets brought on because he's really smart, and for you guys who don't know, he's arguably the smartest guy in the Marvel Universe. It's like Reed Richards, Dr. Doom, Hank Pym, those are the dudes right there. So anyhow, they master interdimensional travel and they go to this dimension that looks like the nether realm from Mortal Kombat. This crazy shit happens and that bank robber guy from The Mask, that's what I know him from. Every time I see this dude in the trailer, I just think of myself, the doctor is about to operate. Sometimes someone does a role that so completely sticks in my head, that's his. But he's like, I wanna know where my kids are at. But someone in the trailer says four of them survived, which implies there's a fifth. The fifth you assess is probably Doom. And now they start exhibiting these powers, powers you know and we're all familiar with. Reed Richards stretches like rubber, Sue Storm can become invisible and she creates energy force fields and shit. Ben Grimm becomes a big rock man. He looks really cool in this trailer. I was like, that's a good looking Ben Grimm. I just love the fact that he actually looks like a rock guy. And Johnny Storm, of course, has the best power of all of them, he becomes a big human torch. Literally, he becomes like a flaming man, other flaming men. And they're like, you opened a door and you don't know how to close it. You don't know what's coming through. What's coming through? Doom. And we see Doom and he has like a metal face and no mouth. Is he gonna talk at all? Is he gonna sound like Kenny from South Park or like But right here guys, I feel like we've been trolled. Cause it was told to us that Doom is actually Dom Chev. He's a blogger and we're, everyone was like, what? Even myself, I was like, that's a stupid ass concept for Dr. Doom. I want Dr. Doom. Ultimately, the last Fantastic Four franchise wasn't good pretty much at all. But the biggest travesty of the entire thing for me was Dr. Doom. And this one looked to be no different. I'm like, you're making him a blogger that's dumb as shit. But you look at it and he obviously is one of the ones who goes through this interdimensional portal with them. Why on earth would they take a blogger? Were they like, all right, we need a crew of five to go through the portal. We need a scientist, the muscle, the hot rod, the other scientist, and the blogger. It's blogger in time. I mean, honestly, you look at that ensemble I just rattled off. None of it makes any sense, but he's got to be more than just a blogger for this movie. Otherwise, why on earth would they send him? I feel like there's something else going on, guys. Something we don't know yet. And I gotta say, this movie is like a good looking movie that just happens to have Fantastic Four characters in it, which makes it kind of a weird spin on the Fantastic Four universe. But if we're looking at it, Fantastic Four, as beloved as it is, is kind of cheesy. It doesn't always translate well to the big screen. I feel like after the last hurrah, people were like, we gotta go another direction. Otherwise, it's just gonna be the same shit that didn't work last time. So I gotta say this new take on the Fantastic Four isn't a bad move, I don't think. It's gonna put some people off, but I'm not writing this movie off completely. It's a good concept and an interesting looking movie. It looks like it's a well shot movie. It's an intriguing trailer. And I feel like there's something else going on with Doctor Doom. I really hope he's not just a blog. It kind of looks like Dr. Smith from Lost in Space after he turned into the bug. So we'll see with this one. I'm like cautiously optimistic for this movie, but I'm like, I don't think you're going to suck as badly as people probably think you're going to suck. All right, guys. So the new Fantastic Four trailer. Have you seen that? What did you think of it? Whatever you thought, comment below. Let me know. I'm going to give you guys some explanations. Of, first of all, the number one requested thing on my channel, Twitter, Facebook, everything. A review of Daredevil. It's as simple as this. I started watching Daredevil with my friend. He went on a little bit of a vacation. So so he's been gone. We watched like a few episodes. I'm waiting for him to get back because that's the kind of loyal dude I am. So you guys will get a review of Daredevil when I'm done watching Daredevil after my friend comes back and we finish watching Daredevil. And I'm pretty sure the universe will survive without a review of Paul Blart Mall Cop 2. Unfriended, I do want to watch. I make no promises, but I do want to watch that one. Just hard to go back when the universe just presses on like this. Like all this stuff is coming out. It's like trailers, trailers, trailers. I like talking about those. So we'll see what happens, but that's just kind of how it's been. Those are the events. And as always, if you like what you've seen here and you want to see more, click right here to see more.